We present Occupancy Networks, a method for learning 3D reconstruction in function space. Existing representations for 3D reconstruction discretize the 3D space in different ways. Spatially in voxel representations, in terms of predicted points, or in terms of vertices and faces of meshes. However, these representations are either restricted to low resolutions, require additional post-processing or cannot represent arbitrary topologies. Occupancy networks represent geometry implicitly as a decision boundary of a deep learning classifier. In this example, the 3D surface of the bench is represented as the decision boundary separating the blue from the red points. The input to our occupancy network architecture are 3D locations and the output of a task-specific encoder network. Our architecture outputs occupancy probabilities for each of the 3D points. Our experiments show that occupancy networks are highly expressive and can be used effectively both for supervised and unsupervised learning. We now demonstrate how occupancy networks can be used for inferring 3D reconstructions from a single RGB image. While voxel, point or mesh-based representations result in discretization artifacts, our method is able to predict smooth and accurate 3D geometry. Next, we show how our method can be used to predict water-type meshes from sparse 3D point clouds. Again, we observe that existing approaches suffer from discretization artifacts. In contrast, our method is able to accurately reconstruct the 3D shape from the input. Our method can also be used to super-resolve coarsely voxelized inputs by predicting a continuous mesh based on a voxel representation as input. Note how our method is able to predict fine structures from the coarse volumetric inputs. Our method can also be used in the context of latent variable models. In this example, we trained a variational autoencoder to obtain a generative model of 3D shapes. Here, we show 3D decodings when linearly traversing the latent space for different object classes. Please visit our website for more information and code. Thanks for watching.